Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to overlay your action bar. So you can see this image right here. The action bar is overlaid over top of the background or the activity, but the activity still extends through that. So yes, it would be cut off, but we can add padding so that nothing will be cut off when it covers up like that. This is nice because now it won't be squished. So like, let's say this stat uh, action bar gets hidden. Uh, every time you have to hide it or unhide it, the entire activity has to get readjusted for the new size, which is demanding on your processor and it's going to look funny when the user is running it. So if we can just use this overlay, like I'm about to show you, we won't have that problem. Here's what we need to do. We can go to Android Studio, go down to App, then to Res or Resources, and then down to Values. Go down to Styles, and hopefully you'll see this app theme here. Could be nice to Nels but just the default one, whatever you got there. Check the name of it. Check to see if it says app theme or whatever it says, whatever. And then go over to app manifest, Android manifest, and just verify here that the theme is the same thing. Like mine says app theme and app theme. Make sure those are the same. That way that your manifest is telling your application to build with the theme that you're specifying here. But if you just specified a random theme, then you know it's not going to know all that work we just did. So basically what I've done here is made it so I can support any version. You will only need you know one but just so people are supporting like 15 and up and people supporting uh, I think it is 10 and up just so they can see but you'll use Android action bar style or you'll just remove it Android and have action bar style and you're going to have that as at style action bar theme. Notice they both say that. And then you'll create a new style down here called action bar theme. Add this part here where it says Android act window action bar overlay and set that to true. If that doesn't work for you, you can also try Android window bar true. If that does not work for you either, try Android window action mode overlay. If none of those work for you, you can try a combination of them or all of them as I am using right now. So now it will overlay. Your activity could be cut off because your action bar is essentially now on top of your activity instead of your activity is right below your action bar. So as you can see in this activity, we have the action bar up here and the activity is below that. But with what we just did, the activity will now extend up in here, but you won't see it. So what we're going to need to do is add some padding. As you can see, there's padding here. That way this is not covered up inside here. So to add that padding, we need to go to our drawable. I'm sorry. We need to go to our layout. Make sure in each one of these that we want the padding. We add Android padding top equals, I'm assuming that's attribute slash action bar size. So we'll take out the action bar size and insert it in here. That way your activity will start here like normal or at least like the buttons and stuff. Hopefully you guys learned from this video how to overlay an action bar. If you didn't or if you need help please contact me in the comments below and subscribe for more videos.